teenager is in critical condition tonight after being struck by a school bus in St. Paul. It happened at the intersection of Maryland Avenue and Dale Street just after 7 this morning. Police say the bus driver didn't see the 15 year old boy crossing the street. As our Kate Raditz explains, it's part of a bigger safety problem in St. Paul. Bad way to start the day. Tire tracks mark the spot where a school bus heading west on Maryland Avenue turned left onto Dale Street in St. Paul. Police say the 50 year old driver never saw the teenager in the crosswalk. When the bus did make that turn, he struck the pedestrian in the crosswalk. I would have to Rick Hansen found the boy lying in the street with his legs under the bus, but they were not pinned down by the wheels. He had blood on his face. You know, he had throw up on the front of his mouth, you know, um, wasn't very uh, coherent. Police say the boy is a sophomore at Como Park Senior High School. A parent told WCCO he's on the robotics team, while another woman hung balloons in the intersection in support of the student. Police say this accident makes it close to 50 pedestrians that have been struck by vehicles in St. Paul so far this year. Everybody needs to pay a little better attention to the rules of the road regarding pedestrian safety. The driver of the bus, operated by the Hmong American Partnership in St. Paul, is cooperating with the investigation. Police do not believe he was impaired. You know, it was just a scary experience. You know, it could be anybody's kid. It could be your kid, you know, my kid, anybody's kid. Uh, as we said, the 15-year-old is in critical condition. This evening, he's at Regents Hospital. St. Paul, uh, Paul police say it is possible the bus driver could face charges.